another video. How are we all? I'm currently on a, a record spree, so I have. Well, I'm not. I'm about to start one because I've got so many of these to get through, which is good. It's a good thing. And I'm also drinking water. I don't know if I'm ill. I don't know if something's wrong with me. This is the first time in about 15 years that I've willingly opened a bottle of water on my own. Um, for a video. It's not. I do drink this quite often. I just really dislike the taste of water. It's fucking horrible. It's just so plain and grim. Anybody who openly thinks that they like the taste of water or chat shit. You can sit there and you say, oh, I like the taste of water. You say, fuck off. You probably drink black tea, you fucking weirdo. No one likes the taste of water. You're lying to, not only me, you're lying to yourself. Fuck you. Anyways, today we're going to take a look at the Cycron. Cycron. The Corpus Beemo. I didn't even know this was a bean till the other day. When I started building it, which is, it, it's, it's actually really fucking good. I built it, like, well, I, I leveled it up to 30 and then scrapped it, and I don't know why I did, because it's actually quite decent. Like I said, now it's boom, and it's going for the ammo, which is pretty cool. So, this is the standard build, and as you see, it's not that bad. It's pretty decent. It's pretty decent. Um, it's got infinite ammo, it's got an initial charge, it's very similar to weapons like the Fulmin, the Shedu, the Basmu, all the recharged weapons. Um, and it's got punch through as well, so it's pretty fucking good. Um, with standard grip mods, it's kind of don't let this fool you. Um, this weapon's a lot better than you know basic grip mods would let it off to be. Unfortunately, with like normal with with not prime grip mods, this weapon doesn't look and doesn't perform as well as. It could. Um, it's so much better with Prime Mods. And you will see that in a minute. But yeah, this is a build for lower level players and maybe players that haven't quite got the Prime Mods yet. As I've started doing. Um, but yeah, it's got High Slash, which is okay. Unfortunately, Viral for this weapon is shit. Um, I don't recommend Viral with this at all. A lot of the beams are pretty shit with Viral, apart from like the Amprax. Every other beam weapon pretty pretty corrosive favoured, which is good. Corrosive should be better against enemies like this. Yeah, like I said, that's with completely standard mods, apart from, I think, I think they all are standard mods. I believe. Yeah, it's all standard. So, I've got six former in this. You don't need six. Four or five. Um, it is expensive. It is annoying. But these are the things we have to do. So, Hornet Strike and Magnum Force for damage. That minus accuracy doesn't affect beams at all. Lethal Torrent for Fire 8 Multi Shot. Barrel Diffusion for Multi Shot. Pistol Gambit and Target Cracker for crit chance crit damage. But 60% crit damage gives me a 2.9 times multi, which is Garbo. And Pistol Gambit is crit chance, which again, isn't really that good. And then Corrosive. So, that's for those of you that don't have the crit mods yet, or you yeah, you haven't got them yet. You know, so yeah, I'm not judging. Shit happens. But this is the build I would recommend. It's the build I'm going to use. This is the good build. Um, I'm not using Magnum Force on this, I'm using Expel Corrupted because I believe it's better, but I will show you how they both work. Again, everything else is pretty much the exact same, just swapped out the two crit mods for the prime mods, which help it a bit more. Not much, but a bit. And the weapon has no fucking impact. Even better, fuck impact. So yeah, that's that. This is the build I'm going to recommend. This is the build I use. I have used this weapon a little bit. I did a meso survival run with this. That. So much better. So much better. So it does have a pretty dog shit crit chance, but decent multi shot. An okay crit multi. And infinite ammo on a beam. So I don't know how to w explain this one or work this one out. I'm saying this weapon doesn't really chain, it's got punch through. 
And a better way to do that would actually be to shoot from the side. So I will show you. And whenever I was using this, I was like, it's a, it's a beam that doesn't change. So statistically, out of them all, I think this is probably the highest single target damage beam in the game. Maybe discounting the new core. The new core might be a bit better. But as you can see, if I shoot this guy in the face, and will completely aim over the head of the other guy and completely ruin my point. So ignore that. Try again. I'll shoot this gun. As you can see, I'm doing shit tons of damage to this one behind us. He's a punch through. This weapon is punching through. See? If I shoot from the side. Kill this guy. This guy's got nothing. It doesn't chain. So this, the beam does not chain between enemies. It's punch through. I don't know how many more times I can emphasize the fact that it's it's punch through. It's did you get that? Punch through. It doesn't chain. It punches through. But yeah, that's just be before anybody gets confused. One meter. One meter's worth of punch through, which is pretty decent. You know, I think this is pretty much a perfect standard for weapons like that. So, yeah, the stats aren't the best, but if a weapon, if a beam weapon doesn't chain for its targets, it should be doing more single target damage, in my opinion. That's how beam should be. If it chains towards a lot of enemies, you know, if I'm shooting this guy and it chains between them all, sure, have it do a little bit less damage because it's spreading it more. But single target, it should definitely do in this kind of damage that that's good i like this i do enjoy, I, I really do enjoy this annoyingly i thought i had a ribbon for this weapon and i don't which is kind of interesting. and another cool feature for those of you that play on console because we're not bigots i'm joking i just yeah fuck you um when it starts recharging it makes a sound so i'm assuming that works on pc as well but when it actually initially charges your controller vibrates, which is pretty decent. Just a little, you know, something extra, because that that actually does nothing. But I don't know. Maybe if you mean you're deaf and you can't hear it recharge, you can feel it recharge instead, which is okay. Just I hadn't noticed any other weapon do that. But when this starts to recharge, your controller vibrates. Yeah, what do you expect? What did you expect? Rhino buff makes everything good. I'm trying to force down this now. Ugh, so boring. Tastes horrible. Hate water. So, out of all the beams, where do I rank this? I rank this one up, up towards the top. It's not the best. Obviously, Newport still wins that by a mile. Newport probably will always win top beam, but you know, we've got the gaze. That's pretty decent. Spectra Vandal, which is really good. Atmos. I don't know. There are a lot of really good beam secondaries, so I'm not sure where I'd rank this. I definitely think it should be used a lot more than it is. Oh, this is going to be annoying, because this weapon doesn't reload. How am I going to proc? Can I proc? Arcane Awakening? I think I can. I didn't think about that, so yeah, my pistol macer isn't going to do as much because I can't proc the one arcane I want to proc. But she doesn't need it. She does not need it. So, um, in my testing, I've tried viral. It doesn't do as much. I'll show you towards the end. Um, yeah, Viral doesn't hit as hard, but obviously this weapon slashes really good without Viral. 
Um, so with with the vial, it's probably just going to make it do a bit more slash damage. Other than that, it doesn't really. Ted at 5k. Pretty decent. Those arcanes again, not buffing sidearms. They are primary arcanes. Because this is a primary mirage. So yeah, that's that. Didn't put carrier on again. Oh well. It's put on normal Nova. I'm sure the colours are gonna go fucked up. Who knows? So if I <clears throat> we'll try this with the uh, Magnum Force and you'll be able to see the difference if you well, I don't know, if you can or can't. I knew it go fuck. Yeah, we're not playing with that. I actually fucking hate the test room for this. <clears throat> Fucks you up. Retia, are you going to be nice? Yeah, you're going to be nice. That'll do. So this is with Magnum 4. As you can see. Bane Corrupted is better. with the Bane mod, it was doing that in about 20 beams, 20 shots, <coughs> but with this, not as much, so, that's not an opinion, that's a fact. Uh, and one last thing, I will put on... viral so you can see but I'll get rid of that so I'm going to be double dipping in my slash procs which is probably going to make this look a little bit better than it would be for those not using it but I always use this mod so that's that as you can see it makes it into a slasher so do a lot more slash damage so if you like watching your enemy bleed out sure use it but I don't But it's not awful, you know, you've got infinite ammo, so if you like slashy weapons, sure you can use this, probably would work. But I don't, I like damage weapons, so I'm, I stick with corrosive, but if you do like it, then it, it works, it's just I think corrosive better. But in long endurance runs, until weapons completely drop off, that might be the better choice for you if you, that's what you like. So that is that. The Cyclone. A pretty decent weapon. I am a fan. Like I said, I do like that weapon. It is awesome. So yeah, there you guys go. If you did enjoy that, leave a like, dislike, if you, for whatever reason. I don't know about Rivens for this weapon. I thought I had one and I don't. So I don't know if I scrapped it or not. I thought my girlfriend had one and it wasn't for that. It was for the Cyanex, which is a completely different weapon, which made me want to hurt myself. Because yeah. I quite like this weapon, so, you know, we can't have nice things. If you can get a Riven, crit chance, damage, multi-shot, crit damage, you know, any of the three. Um, a damage crit chance one would be amazing, so your boy might scour the market for uh, decent Rivens, maybe, we'll see. But yeah, that is that, I will let you guys go. Subscribe if you are new around here, that would be sick. Links to my socials are in the description. Like always, it's been, it, it has been your boy Acid, and I will see you cunts later.